All right, you guys, ZFR back here, and this is going to be a very quick overview of the Goku versus Jiren fight. Just a kind of little review of it, telling you guys what I think um, and just overall what I like because there wasn't really anything I disliked about this fight, and I'm going to talk about right now. This fight was just absolutely amazing. Like It was like perfect almost. Like, I feel like they did a really good job obviously when it came from the animation because they had like all the best animators that work on dragon ball work on this and these two episodes so like that was to be expected but overall like this fight was just absolutely like freaking amazing like i mean this fight served its purpose so well i thought that they did such a good job of making it entertaining the watch and one thing that really surprised me about this fight that I didn't think they would do is how one-sided it was. I knew Jiren was going to be dominating Goku for at least most of the fight, but I wasn't expecting him to dominate him the entire time. Goku only had the upper hand for like a split second in this fight when he first got his new form and he managed to get a knee in on Jiren. Other than that, like, Goku didn't have the advantage at all during this fight. And I wouldn't even go as far to call that moment a moment of advantage. Because Jiren was still, um, you know, on, on his guard. He still um, didn't really get phased or anything. Like, so throughout this entire fight, Jiren, like, pretty much was calm, cool, collected. And not even when Goku had his new form was he phased. Sure, he had to um, actually try a little bit more at that point. But even he knew that, hey, you're, you, you got better. You know, you're stronger and stuff. But you're starting to hit your limit. And I've still got more. And freaking Jiren just absolutely still works Goku. Now, one thing I'm not too sore about, I kind of couldn't real, I didn't really get this part, but I didn't understand whether or not Goku ended up losing the fight because the new form ran out or just simply because he hit a limit in the new form. I, I'm thinking he hit an actual limit because um, you see that he's still in the um, new form one, when he throws that big punch at Jiren, but Jiren catches it and stuff, so... I'm thinking Goku simply just wasn't strong enough even with the new form um, in order to beat Jiren, which is saying a lot. That's really shocking, guys. Um, so, yeah, Jiren's still in this. He's still, like, the juggernaut of the tournament of power. And I really like this episode because this is a perfect midway point. This made... I just made a video the other day saying the tournament of power arc wasn't as tense it wasn't as um suspenseful as i wanted it to be this episode changed that it definitely lived up to the hype it changed my opinion on that um and because now we have all of these different questions we have all this tense and rising now we've seen jiren's power it's like how is anyone going to beat this dude even if vegeta were to um gain that form and gain that power or whatever or goku is able to regain it jiren is still somewhat stronger than that form like uh, or I, I gotta stop calling it a form because it's technically a technique instead of a form from the way they're explaining it so um yeah like this is overall just super exciting guys definitely one of the the best episodes of dragon ball super if not the best i would venture to say this is the best episode of Dragon Ball Super, or these two episodes are the best. Like, I definitely um freaking loved it. I one of my favorite um moments in the entire fight um over the course of these two episodes is actually the spirit bomb struggle when Jiren first starts pushing it back, and you have that epic music playing in the background. That like this fight has just been amazing. It delivered on all fronts and we finally got what I've been asking for in Dragon Ball Super. We finally got something that I wanted and that is a enemy that can't just be um surpassed. Like I'm 
glad we're finally to this point because now these characters can't just reach a new level of power and you know beat the big bad they actually have to um find a way around this they have to work for a different solution and i like that so yeah overall this has been super awesome um this fight has just um been overwhelming i don't really have too much more say about it i am going to talk about different aspects of these two episodes and different videos about this size so keep your eyes open for those but anyway guys thank you so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed leave a like if you did and all that leave a comment and i will see you guys on the next one zfr out guys